With the Revit add-in, we're starting to bring Revit and SpaceMaker closer together by enabling you to bring your work from SpaceMaker to Revit with just a couple of clicks. In this video, I will explain how to install and use the Revit add-in. Firstly, you'll need to log into SpaceMaker, either with your subscription or with SpaceMaker's free 30-day trial. So, here's an example of a proposal I've designed in SpaceMaker. Using SpaceMaker's powerful analytics and generative design tools, I've been working on my feasibility studies and my volumetric models. I'm now ready to move over to Revit to further my design. As this is my first time doing this, I need to install the add-in. I simply click the three dots next to the project, go to Revit, and then click the download option. Now, I simply follow the instructions to complete the installation. Having now installed the add-in, I will go back to my project. Click the three dots again, Revit, and then send to Revit. You'll see a confirmation on the screen. Next, I'll head over to Revit, go to the Space Maker tab, and click Fetch. We'll just need to wait a few seconds, and then, there we go. Revit has imported our site, surrounding buildings, existing buildings, proposal buildings, project base point, and terrain, ready for me to continue to design as needed. This add-in is just our first step in improving interoperability between Revit and SpaceMaker, and we're excited to see how architects will benefit from a smooth workflow that includes these two powerful tools. The add-in is currently in open beta, and we'd welcome any feedback in the SpaceMaker forum.